All right, guys, this is number 94 today. This is a predominantly lower body workout. We will be throwing in a little bit of timed interval work for upper, but for the most part, we're going for lower body. We are going for the large muscle groups. We are going for ultimate burn in the minimum time. All right, I'm not sure how long the workout will be. I will try to keep it under an hour, but because it is reps and timed intervals, it was hard to actually gauge how long it's gonna go, all right, but we'll try to push through it. Um, I am using equipment. You do not need all this equipment, all right? All you need is your dumbbells. I will be using my uh, elevation for the first round. I'll be using a 20 inch and a lower elevation. You can stick with one elevation. It does not have to vary. I'm just doing that because one move is more challenging at a lower elevation and another move is more challenging at a higher elevation, all right? but it's only those moves. So don't worry, if you only have one elevation, just use that. Um, I'm using my kettlebells. I am using my band, my loop bands. I will be using a weight plate, my dumbbells, of course. And for the last set, right at the end, I will be using my barbell and my jump rope, all right? You do not need any of that except some dumbbells, all right? That's what you really need to get this workout in. Please make sure you warm up five to seven minutes because we're going straight into lower body. And please have some water handy because you might need it. All right, here we go. So we are start, oh, I'm also using ankle weights. Ankle weights, totally optional. You do not need them. If you have them, bring them to the side, all right? We're not using them quite yet. All right, so we are starting off with our elevation and one weight that you hold as a goblet, whatever weight you choose to use. We are doing 10 three-quarter goblet squats, which means we have a wide stance. We come down, but not all the way up, three quarters of the way up, all right? 10 reps is what we're starting with. We have four exercises. I will go through them with you five times through. All right, let's start with that goblet. So weight to the chest. Please make sure you are warmed up. I know I keep saying it. And chest up. We're coming down, three quarters up. Keep tension on the legs. One, two, three, four, all the way to the heels. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Slowly, gently, safely get that weight to the side. We are going to the higher elevation if you have two elevations. We are doing a single leg hop. So one foot stays on, we hop it up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. So you're hopping up with that foot that is on your elevation. It's coming off the elevation. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, land soft, and 10. Does not have to be a big hop. All right, we are doing low elevation. We are sitting, coming up for a pop squat. The lower, the more challenging here. Here we go, 10 reps. One, two, pop it up. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Whew. We have 10 chair lunges or box lunges alternating. Sorry, 20, 10 on each leg. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Your whole entire foot 
is on your elevation for those. All right, four more rounds, water up. 10, three quarter goblet squats. Here we go, wide stance. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Squeeze those legs the whole way through that move. All right, little hops, single foot hops. 10 on each side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Switch it up. One, two, three, four, five, Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Oh, ten. Low sit, pop squats, all the way down. Onto your box. One, two, three, four, five. Six, come on, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Oh, legs are waking up. Twenty box lunges or elevated lunges. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Take a little recovery. Round three. Coming up. Three quarter. Goblet squats. Come on. Wide stance. Knees toes slightly out. One. Two. Don't stand all the way up. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Squeeze. Nine. Ten. Uh, single leg box pops. These are the worst ones for me. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Oh, switch it up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, come on, get it up, and ten. Low box pop squats, or right where you did your last move. All right. One, two, three, four, five. Sit back down gently. Six, don't just plop down. Seven, eight, nine, and ten. Oh, twenty. Box switch lunges. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, 
three, two, and one. We have two more rounds. Tap your roll for a second. We are going three quarter goblet squat. Come on. Two more rounds. We got this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ooh. Single leg, box hops, or jumps. Doesn't have to be a big hop. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Switch it up. One, legs are already. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Oh, low box pop squats. These are tough. Lower the tougher. One, two, three. Keep that chest up. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Push through the heels to stand and ten. Oh, 20 box switch lunges. Come on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. If you hinge forward a little bit on those, you're hitting more glutes. All right, you should feel it more in your butt. Choice is yours. All right. Round five. This is it. Three quarter. Goblet squats, come on. One, two, squeeze, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Get that dumbbell to the side. Know that you are done with that for now. All right, single leg hops. One, two, three, four, five, come on, six, get it up there, seven, eight, nine, ten, switch, that supporting leg, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Oh, low, hop, squat, sit from the box. You guys know what I'm saying. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, come on, nine, and ten. 
10. If you are using a low box, set to the side. Know that you're done with that. All right, let's finish with 20 box switch lunges. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. If you are using a high box, put it to the side. Know that you are done with that. Feels good. All right. We are going upper body four times, 20 seconds on, 10 seconds for this one is a plank hold on your hands, all right? So you're on your hands plank holding for 10 seconds. Our 20 second move is a push up, alternate knee in towards the chest, all right? That is it. Here we go, four times through. Only four, and we're done for the upper. Here we go. So, push up, knee drive, push up, switch up that knee. Come on. You have 10 seconds. Keep that neck in line with your spine for the push ups. Three, two, hold it here for 10 seconds. Fingertips are wide. You can open up your feet for a wider base. It helps. Here we go. Push up. Knee drive. Push up. Knee drive. Come on. 10 seconds. Squeeze that knee in towards your chest. Get the abs involved. Lower abs. Hold it up. Two more rounds. Push ups in three. Two, go, push up, knee drive, push up, knee drive, come on, keep that butt down, 10 seconds, you guys got this, chest to the floor, three, two, hold that plank, last time, guys this is the only, these are the only upper body moves you're going to get, these short, 20 second intervals. Ready? Push up. Knee drive. Come on. Last time. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two. Ten second hold. Ten second hold. Come on. Five, four, three. Two and one. Oh, shake it out. We are back to lower body. All right, so set two. We are using our ankle weights. If you do not have ankle weights, you are holding two dumbbells at your side. All right, I am opting to go only with my ankle weights so that I really focus on each move. If I was not using these, I would be holding my, probably my two 10 pounds in each hand because this is a six minute round, all right? As many rounds as possible. So we're gonna start off with the left leg. You're gonna do a reverse lunge, come up, Chamber that knee so that it's 90 degrees. Foot flexed, you extend like you're on a leg extension machine. All right, five rounds. Same leg. After those, curtsy, side leg raise. Five, sorry, five reps, not five rounds. All right, five reps. And then, same leg is coming behind. You lunge, I'll show you. Lunge, static lunge, glute raise. All right, on that same side for five reps. 
Okay, so after we finish those five reps for those three exercises on the left side, we move to the right leg, all right? It is six minutes going back and forwards after each three rounds of five reps. Follow me, stay with me if you can. All right, so we are starting off left leg, reverse lunge, leg extension. I'm setting my timer now, left leg comes back, right leg is to the front. Deep lunge, come up, chamber, extend, that's one. My foot is flexed, two, not pointing my toes, three, you can do this with weights at the side, four, and five. Now going into that curtsy, same leg, curtsy, leg raise, one, two, three, four, five, same leg comes back, left leg back, static lunge, bring it up for a glute raise, one, two, so straight down and up, three, four, and five, switching it up, right leg, deep lunge, chamber, Extend, one, take your time, two, three, you're past your one minute mark, four, and five, right leg, curtsy, side leg raise, one, two, come on, get it up there, three, four, and five, right leg back, static, glute raise, one, two, hold it for a second at the top, three, four, and five, back to our left, deep lunge, you're two minutes in, chamber, extend, one, two, get a deep lunge, three, four, five, same leg, curtsy leg raise, one, two, three, four, and five, static glute raise, one, come on, two, three, four, and five, you're nearly at the half way mark, right leg, lunge, chamber, extend, one, don't think about it, two, just focus on your moves, three, four, Ooh, get your balance, and five, curtsy, side leg raise, one, hips are forward, two, three, four, come on, and five, static leg raise, one, two, three, four, five, squeeze that glute at the top, back to our left, nice deep lunge, chamber, one, come on, you have two minutes, two, three, extend, squeeze the front of the leg, four, and five, curtsy, side leg raise, one, two, come on, you have a minute and a half, three, four, five, 
five, static glute raise. One, two, three, four, and five. Reverse lunge with the right. Leg extension, you have your last minute coming up. One, come on. Two, work on that balance. Your core is getting it. Two, three, four, and five. Curtsy, side leg raise. One, 45 seconds. Two, three, four, and five. Static glute raise, you have 30 seconds. One, two, three, four, and five. Let's do leg extension. One, from the left. Two, three, four, and five. Let's get the right. Lunge, extend. One, two, three, four, and five. I took you 15 minutes, 15 seconds over rather, but we are even. All right, if you're using ankle weights, get those to the side, know that you are done with those. All right, upper body is a plyometric push-up. You do not have to do a plyo push-up. You can do a regular push-up, all right? I'm gonna try to stick with plyo the whole way. So, I'm doing plyometric push-up, down, into a burpee, all right? So I'm not gonna get many reps in. After my plyo, I come down, bring it up for a burpee. If you're just doing regular, regular burpees with a push-up. Ready, four rounds, here we go. So, plyo push-up, if you're doing it like me, down, jump it up. Just a regular push-up is fine. But get that push-up. Three, two, and one. Hold it here, hip dips. You can stay on your forearms, butt legs are wide, or you can stay on your hands. Two, and go. Plyo push-up, or regular. If your floor is slippery, watch those plyo push-ups, please. Three, two, hip dips. Come on, two more rounds, and go. Regular or plyo push-up burpee. Two and hip dips. If you're on your forearms, your hips are coming closer to the floor. I'm keeping it up here so I can go straight in, right in. Come on, last 20. seconds. Keep it going. Five, four, three, two, last hip dips. I'm on my forearms. Five, three, two, and one. Oh, good job, guys. All right. If you have your band, this is where you need it, all right? And your plate. Water up. You cannot 
either use your kettlebells or a dumbbell, all right? You do not need a band. You do not need a plate. You do not need a kettlebell. But that is what I'm using. So my plate, putting it right here in front of me. We are doing banded at the ankles plie swing. So my knees and toes are out. I'm bending through my knees and I am coming out to the front with my swing, just like a regular swing, except my knees and toes are pointed out and I am going to band it. All right? So we are doing 50 seconds of that move. Our 30 second move, if you have an elevation, you are moving your band up. If you like to use your band up above your knees, you're just gonna go, stay low, heels elevated over your plate. Just going around in a little clockwise circle. If you get dizzy, you can switch it up. All right, that is it. I think I'm gonna hold maybe my lighter kettlebell for that move to give my grip a little break. All right, because we're going 50, 40, 30, 20 seconds for the swings, all right? The plate move remains at 30 seconds the whole way through. All right, so here we go. Bend at the ankles, plie. So knees and toes are out. We have 50 seconds in four, three, two, and go. Swing, knees and toes are out like a plie squat. Shoulders are back. We are not rounding them forward. Just like a regular swing. All the way through the heels, hamstrings, and glutes. You have 50 seconds. More than halfway there. You should feel the inner thighs here. Ten seconds. Five, four, three, two, and ten second recovery. I'm bringing that weight, that band over my knees, holding my lighter kettlebell. Here we go. Heels are elevated. Just staying low, going clockwise or counterclockwise around that plate. It is a tiny step, not a wide step. Stay nice and low. Your heels are elevated. If you're not using a plate, you can just do side to side, low walks or death walks. Two and one. All right, get that band down around your ankles. We have 40 seconds. Plie swings and go. Same move. Plie. Knees and toes are out. Come on. You are bending through the knees here to get that swing. Close now. 
now. Stay with me. Ten seconds. Use those glutes. Inner thighs. Come on. Four, three, two, and one. Get that weight to the side. Bring your band up. Oh, 30 seconds. I'm gonna switch my the way I'm moving now. Come on. Stay low. We have one more round of these. Keep low. Keep that butt back. Woo. Tiny little shuffle around your plate. Ten seconds. Oh, toes are firmly into the floor. Four, three, two, and one. I want to make sure you can see my watch. Ten seconds. Bring it down. Last 20 second round. Plies, toes, knees out, and go. Come on. Get power into that swing. It's your last plie one. 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. 10 seconds. Whew. Bring that band over your knees, onto your thighs. Last 30, and go. Stay low. Get a bit lower. Come on. Keep moving. 15 seconds. I'm going to change direction. 10. Three, two, and one. Oh. Okay. Water up. Keep that band. Oh. All right. Keep that plate. Keep your band. We are doing a short range swing. All right, so the band goes back down around your ankles. This is not gonna be a full swing where you come all the way up and you shoot your hips forward. All right, I want you to keep work on the glutes and hamstrings. Knees are now forward, toes are forward, but you're stopping right about here. All right, so you're not coming up here, you're stopping right about here. All the tension stays on the glutes and hamstring the whole way through. All right, we are doing 50 seconds. What we are pairing that with is 30 seconds of a banded, oh, bring the band up, no wonder it didn't work. Banded, I'll show you profile. Forward to back. All right, forward to back. My knee does not come beyond my toes. It is a small movement. Static lunge hold, forward to back, you stay low. All right, we alternate legs. We'll do two and two. All right, just follow along. Here we go. So, short range, short range swing to start for 50 seconds, starting now. So, short range means there is constant tension on your glutes and hamstrings. Knees and toes are pointing forward. It's almost like a pulse, all right? It's not a full swing. 30 seconds. Low. 
I am on my left toes. I am pressing through my right heel as I shift my weight forward to back. I am low the whole time. Come on. Don't let that knee come over your toes. Keep it behind the toes. Three, two, and one. 10 seconds. Bring that band around the ankles. Short range. 40 second swing. In three, two, go. Knees and toes are forward. Short range. You are squeezing through the back of the legs. Come on. 20 seconds. You should feel the glutes and hamstrings. They get no break here. Tension is on the whole time. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right. Bring it up, forward to back. Same leg on the elevation. Same leg back and go. Get a nice wide stance for these. Nice wide lunge. Come on, all the way in the front heel. Stay low. You guys got this, stay with me. Come on, 10 seconds. Five, three, two, and one. Oh, 30 second short range. Bring that band down around the ankles. 30 seconds and go. Knees and toes are forward. Shoulders are back. We switch up. Which foot is elevated for that forward to back move? Three, two, and one. 10 seconds. Bring that band up. Opposite foot is elevated. Opposite leg back. And go forward to back 30 seconds. Guys, we are so close now. Come on, we have one more round of these. Plate and band moves. Actually, we're not using a band for the next one though. Three, two, and one. Oh, all right. We have our 20 second round. Bring that band down, knees, toes forward, short range, 20 seconds, and go. Oh. Keep that tension on. If you have a plate, you are doing 
a side to side shuffle with your plate. Get wide, get low. You are using the inside of your foot to get that plate side to side. All right, our first move is, that's our second move. Our first move, however, is a low lateral lunge with a swing. All right, so you are in a low lateral lunge position, swinging the weight onto the side of the leg, of the side where the knee is bending. All right, this is not a Cossack squat. Our toes are not coming up. All right, your foot stays flat. Your heel is where all your weight is the whole entire time. All right, so let's start there. 50 seconds on, and here we go. So nice wide, lunge, lunge. Your feet stay on the floor. You stay low the whole time. Your toes are not coming off the ground. They're not pointing up towards the ceiling. Watch your knees. Does not have to be a fast motion, but it has to be a controlled one. And it should be a low one. Push through that heel. 20 seconds. Keep those shoulders back, chest up. 10. Stay low. Come on. 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. 10 seconds. We have our 30 second move. It's our plate side shuffle or a banded lateral walk. And go. Get a nice wide stance, whichever move you're doing. Stay low. If you lose it, find it again. Come on. We are so close, guys, now. 10 seconds. Four, three, two, and one. My floors are not ideal, but again, I do what I can. All right, wide stance. 40 seconds, swings. Lateral line in the swing, go. 40 seconds, chest up. Get into that wide, oh, pushing through the heels. Inner thighs are getting it again, so are the glutes. You can pick your pace. You can go faster, you can go slower. Just keep good form and stay low. Five, four, three, two, and one. 10 seconds, back to that side shuffle or side banded walk. Two, and go, 30 seconds. Guys, focus, stay low. I often find that if I start thinking, that's when I make mistakes, all right? I focus. Don't let your mind wander. We're at the end of the workout now. 10 seconds. We have pepper and our little cardio section to finish up. Four, three, two, and one. 10 seconds, we have our 30 second round. Low lateral swings. In three, two, and go. 30 seconds. Shoulders back. Lateral side to side. It's not a forward to back motion. Come on. Five, four, three, two, and one. Oh. Ten seconds. Shuffle or walks. Come on, we have one more round. And go. Stay low.
Keep going. Come on, 10 seconds. Stay low. Five, four, three, two, and one. Last time. 20 second lateral lunge with the swing. Find your wide stance and go. All through the heels, come on. 10 seconds. Stay low, get lower. Five, four, three, two, and one. Oh, all right. 10 second shuffle or walk in for 30. In three, two, and go. Stay low, it's your last 30 seconds here. We have an upper body, and then we are finishing it up with our cardio. We'll go by fast, I promise. Come on. Get that plate, or your band, or your medicine ball, whatever you're using. I tried with the medicine ball. I couldn't quite keep it in check. Four, three, two, and one. Oh, shake it out, shake it out, shake it out. Water up. We are moving to upper body. All right, guys, get your bands to the side. You are done. Get your kettlebells to the side. You are done. All right, we are doing 20 seconds of upper body. We're gonna do a kneeling, hands are tight into the side of the body. You're gonna kneel, you're gonna fall, come on to your hands, push up, all right? So it's a kneeling, fall forward, tricep, push up. Kneeling, fall forward, off the knees, tricep, push up. Bring it back up. Fall forward gently, tricep push up. If you don't like that, you can just do walk out tricep push ups, all right? And in your 10 seconds, you are holding a low tricep push up. All right, we have four rounds. And then we just have our cardio. So let's finish this up in three, two, and one. So I'm gonna do kneeling, fall forward, bring my knees off the floor, push up. Back. Five, four, three, two. Now hold it low. Hold that push up. Hold that tricep push up. For five, four, three, two. Bring it up. Kneeling. Fall forward. Catch myself. Bring my knees off the floor. Guys, if these bother your wrists, walk it out. Three, two, and low hold. Come on, keep that core tight. Elbows to the side of the body. Three, two, kneeling. Woo. Fall forward, catch yourself, push up. Five, four, three, two, hold it low. 10 seconds. You have one more round. Five, four, three, two, kneeling. Woo. Forward, push up. Come on. You can also do the fall standing if it bothers your knees. It was just a smoother, quicker transition for me to stay kneeling. Three, two, and low hold, 10 seconds. Come on. Tighten up that whole body. Five, four, three, two, and one. Oh, all right. Good job. Upper body, triceps, back of the arms specifically. Really felt that, all right. We have 
R, cardio, five times through. Okay, this is going to be a bit of a doozy. Do what you can with what you have, all right? I am using my barbell. You can do this with uh, sandbag, you can do it with dumbbells, or you can just do a regular um, jack or a low squat jack if you're not comfortable with this move, all right? We are doing a deadlift. So wide deadlift, my legs are out wide, make sure you're not gonna get stuck on your mat here. Legs are wide, deadlift, bring it up, not up right row. Deadlift, up and close. Deadlift and close. So we open the legs, jack in the legs. Open the legs, jack in the legs. All right? We are not using the lower back here. We're using the hamstrings and glutes. If this bothers your lower back, you're not doing this, all right? You can just do an open and close jack for five reps, all right? After that, we are using our low elevation. If you have it, if you don't, no worries. All right, we are doing 20 side to side hops. All right, after that, we are on our rope for 30 seconds, low squat hold. So you're jumping rope, squatting low hold, or one leg back, lunge low hold, or regular jump rope, all right? I'll show you the variations as we go. All right, here we go. So we have five rounds. Let's start off with the deadlift into a jack. Four, five rounds. Here we go. All right, so deadlift, bring it up, close the legs. One, wide legs, in two, three, four, and five. Send that weight to the side. 20 up and overs, or side to side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. Jump rope. Low squat hold if you can for 30 seconds. So I'm in a little squat position. I'm holding it. Or you can do lunge. Anything you guys feel like doing. Try to engage the lower body. Thank <laughs> you. 
stomach, all right? All right, five, wide, open to close. This is round three. Let's start with that deadlift. Wide, in, one, two, three, four, flat back, and five. Just like a regular deadlift. All right, 20 up and overs. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. On your own. 30 seconds, your choice. Try to engage your legs. I'm gonna do switch lunges. This is round three of five. We have two more. Come on, 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. Deadlifts. Come on. Wide to narrow with the legs. Five reps. One, two, three, four. Shoulders are back. Five. Up and over. One, stay low. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Thirty second jump rope. I'm gonna go back to my switch lunges. And go, 30 seconds. Try to stay low.
It's probably a 50 minute workout with my talking in between. So good calorie burn. I will certainly feel this in my lower body tomorrow. I hope to see you guys at 95.